Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to Forza Motorsport 4. Today is episode number 75. If you guys are enjoying the content, then be sure to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe, and feel free to hit that join button as it really does help support the channel. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. This episode was streamed live on YouTube. If you want to make sure to catch the streams, then be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation, or PC, then check out Eniba in the description down below. All right, so we're here for the Voxel Hatch Showcase. We're going to be taking, surprise, surprise, a Voxel. Uh, we start off with Top Gear West, then Camino Vio, Iberian International, and then Hockenheim Ring. Let's get going. Why not try adding a little bit of bongo? <laughs> it's so posh. <laughs> this is such a tune. I love this. Why did this have to be the song that came on when I clicked shuffle? Oh, I love it. Ah, you pillock. Bubba Bongo. I'm actually quite a big fan of like old school like 2000s drum and bass. Like this, this is what I would call and categorize as 2000s drum and bass. It's that sort of not low quality, but like it, it's just simple drums. It's just and there's a little bass line. That is goodbye from me and goodbye from Music Club. No, but I think that's what I enjoy about drum and bass is it's not serious music. Like you look at all the big artists, they have like proper productions and everything like that. And drum and bass, it just seems to be like, oh look, let me load up some software on a computer and make some tunes. Like, I don't know. I quite like it. I think this is from the same album as well. Yeah, can't get enough. This is a good one. Whoop! Must use pre installed phone software. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> pre installed phone software is like. Ugh. Makes me want to be sick. Old Sony Ericsson music software. Jesus Christ. Way better than any Java games like that. The fact that Java doesn't exist now just it, it blows my mind. Is it Java that doesn't exist or Flash? I can't remember. No, it might be Flash. I might be mixing the two up. But the flat, the fact that Flash doesn't exist, I thought Java was Oracle.
I thought Java was owned by Oracle. Yeah, Java is owned by Oracle. Same people that, um... Uh, what's it called? Uh, Oracle was bought by Microsoft. Ah, uh, that could be a possibility then. That could be a possibility. Because Oracle is like a really popular software for like, um, companies and whatnot. Uh, like making company software. So that wouldn't surprise me, actually. Collaboration equals more money for them. Exactly. I think the amount of money that's actually involved with businesses nowadays is unbelievable. Like, I don't think companies or, like, people should be allowed to spend $69 billion to buy another company. To, like, that just seems like ridiculous amounts of money. And the fact that some companies can afford that... I think there's some shady shit going on. Like, there is no way in hell any company operates within legal parameters. There's no way. Yeah, I'd take 60 billion. To be fair, I take a thousand pounds right now. Like, if someone could just say, right, here, here's a thousand pounds. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Mr. B should come to the UK and do like videos in the UK. I'd be more than happy to take ten thousand pounds off of Mr. B. <laughs> Thank you so much, good sir. The you know, one thing I find really ironic, right, is there are people comparing Mr. Beast to, like, Squid Game and, like, comparing him to what is essentially, like, they're saying that he's exploiting poor people and whatnot. But the thing that I do not understand is we've watched what for 40 50 60 years watch tv companies recover retirement for three generations after i die three generations and the rest you'll be able to retire forever and retire the next like 500 years of your children literally maybe so much money it's unreal But yeah, um, what's it called? TV channels have done it for like 50 years. Where people who are looking to win money go onto a game show to win money. And nobody's gone to those TV channels and gone, you're exploiting poor people. Like, 
I just th I just think it's funny. I think the internet is hilarious because they're just brain dead. Oh, I dropped my mouse. Don't look like it is. Absolutely loving chasing status at the moment. Like, when this album comes out, I kid you not, it's going to be on repeat. I've already, by the way, chat, I've already listened to, um, what's it called? Chasing Status. I've listened to their songs 300 times this month. Like, I've played a song of theirs 300 times this month. The most I've ever listened to an artist in a month was the first time that I ever got Tidal. And that was The weekend, And I had 320. But I was at work in an office and I was listening to music 8 hours a day. And yet somehow, while I'm now not listening to music 8 hours a day... I've managed to pull off those numbers with Chase and Status with what is essentially three songs. It's insane. The amount of times that I've listened to Liquor and Cigarettes and Badadan is unreal. Who wants to be a millionaire offered one mil for real, though? They just manipulated the answer poll. 100%. The issue is, though, the amount of advertising revenue that they would get from an episode of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire would be about a million pounds. Maybe even more. So they could quite easily give that away at every show. Never give up. This is one of my favourite Chase and Status songs. Sitting by black and blue. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Stop under steering. Thank you. Lovely. Never give a uh oh. We've got three more motorsports streams and then the WRC stream on. Someone. When is it? I can't remember. The 31st. How have I forgotten that? ADHD brain moment. You reused my joke. Nobody better than we. I'm not even kidding. This is like the eighth time we've played either Badadan or Liquor and Cigarettes this stream.
like, you can't say it's, like, <laughs> not reused. I doubled it and sent it to someone else. <laughs> uh, that's fucking great. I love that. Yo, would you like to take this fuck I have? Or would you like to double it and give it to the next person? <laughs> oh! Yeah, we haven't done a good job there. <laughs> Double it, hundred percent. Oh, this is that uh, Sam Fender song. Beep beep, get out of the way. I give a lot of ducks. Fuck a duck. You're a duck. You're a duck in fuck. Cleanest driving you'll ever see. He's got go faster stripes now. Why are you not turning? Turn, you fat pig! There we go. Just scream at it a little, it works. I haven't heard Badadam for a long time. We must listen to it again. <laughs> That's literally what my brain does, though. It's just like, oh, I want to listen to Badadan. I want to listen to Badadan. Where's Badadan? Where's Badadan? Where's Badadan? I want to listen to Badadan. Honestly, anyone that's listening to this like YouTube video in like three or four years' time will be like, what the fuck is he on about? Badadan. We'll get like 10 years into the future and there'll be one of those TikToks that's like, Oh, th this time 10 years ago, Badadam was the best song in the world. Or something like that. I mean, it is. It's literally... It's been climbing every month. Or every week. Which is unbelievable. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.